Hey, this is Ryan Sweeney reporting to you from Tiger Vision. In the studio today, we got a real special guest, an ogre from his swamp all the way on the outskirts of Duloc. We got Shrek. I'm not going to shake your hand because it's all green. This is an interview of Shrek with Tiger Vision, and I think the people want to know why. I understand why you might wonder. It was high school, Spanish 2 class. She signed a project. She's like, write this project on any person you want. Give him 10 articles of clothing, write an essay in Spanish. And I'm like, oh, Miss Platt, you don't know what you've just done. <laughs> you've awoken. I choose Shrek as my character. I wrote all this about him about how he's like awesome and it was in Spanish so it was technically Shreknically allowed. That night before the presentation, I made a Shrek costume, homemade. I went up there, gave my presentation. Everybody was like, this is the weirdest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. Yeah, that's pretty much the story of how it started. Do you go by Shrek at the house? Like, do your parents call you Shrek? My parents, um, they don't want to call me Shrek. I don't think they want to accept that I am Shrek. They, they call me my legal name, which I don't want them to. It's like, who, who wants to be called by your legal name when you could be called Shrek? On game days, you do a little bit extra, right? Shrek Why don't you talk about that? I think you meant Shrekstra. But, Shrekstra. Uh, so I got a karaoke machine when I started hosting karaoke, and I decided, hey, this karaoke machine wheels around, okay? Use that ogre brain of yours, Shrek. Think for a minute. And then I started wheeling around that karaoke machine. How Good tall thing. is Shrek? Shrek, he's like, it varies, but I'd say he's about, I think. Your height varies? About eight foot. Eight foot. Eight foot, I'd say. Are you planning any crossovers with any other DreamWorks? Cross ogres. Cross ogres with other DreamWorks movies. I feel like a Shrek, Kung Fu Panda, How to Train Your Dragon crossover, you know? Hiccup with his dragons, Poe and Shrek all have to fight it out. <laughs> Obviously, Shrek would win, but you know, it'd still be. Are you worried that the Kung Fu Panda would, it would be able to squadoosh you into nothing? It's skadoosh. Skadoosh. No, no, I don't think Poe would be, he wouldn't have fast enough reflexes to catch Shrek. Shrek, he can move at the speed of light, he just chooses to move a little slower so he can interact with the humans. You remember the scene in Shrek 1 where he sneaks up on those villagers? <laughs> you think he could be going any less than the speed of light? Come on. on the marble arch and love is not a victory match it's a cold and it's a broken hallelujah 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 all right Shrek, thank you so much for coming in. All right, Wait. this is Ryan Sweeney from Tiger Vision, signing off. Now get out of my studio. <laughs> we are now. Why don't you get in the shot, man? I'm Come in on. the shot. It's just so difficult with you. Uh, <laughs> all right, I'm going to head out. <laughs>